Hello fellow engineers and welcome back to Polybridge 3. We are currently working through this campaign. We're on the Serene Cyclades, which is a three sheep difficulty. And we're completing these under budget and unbreaking. But not only that, because I was a real engineer, we are getting in the top 1% for all of these levels. We are making stupidly cheap solutions to these. So this level is called Looper Rising. Uh, 99 grand budget, a load of materials. What is going on? Oh, looks like we literally we have to do a loop that makes sense so let's just see how fast does that car go it goes pretty fast okay uh, my next sort of thought is well i mean i feel like the sort of solution they want you to go for is like that sort of thing i feel like that's going to be quite a lot of bridge if you know what i mean so i'm wondering could i get away with perhaps doing like that sort of thing maybe so we hit that star and go straight up then i don't know if we land on a ramp like that that's like so much cheaper that was 12 grand before remember we're we're like well under 10 uh, so i guess for now let's just use steel and really try and get this thing strong i'll put a wall brace under there trusses like that in like that uh, hopefully this is strong enough oh my goodness that was not strong enough okay how about that okay so we get both the stars oh but then it comes straight back down i'm thinking if we just try and tilt this ramp forwards a bit then yes okay it lands on that road which is where we want it to land if we do something like that then that comes down oh that's actually nearly good you break so what I might do, I might just flop the road like on top. So I think that's breaking because it's being crushed. Yeah, something broke underneath, but that's good. I just want to get a feel for, for what the leaderboards are going to look like. Okay, so we want to be sort of probably like 30 grand-ish. don't know how many people have completed, but yeah, 30 to 40 grand should see us in the top 1%. Uh, what I'm wondering though, would it actually be cheaper to use foundation? rather than like all this steel because like whilst i can probably swap some of these to wood we're gonna need quite a big support underneath whereas if we had a foundation we actually found it that's very expensive that's 18 grand okay we can't have a foundation oh scared myself there i thought i was gonna i thought i was gonna go for a foundation for a sec oh honestly i'm gonna need steel like quite a lot in this level so yeah basically anywhere where i don't have steel we're just completely crashing and dying if i do that yeah swap that bit with steel then we sort of have like a steel arch i mean yes there's there's a lot of steel on this side i mean i could probably swap some of this so you can sort of see where like the strongest bits of force are oh no oh it didn't work wait what i didn't even change the road oh okay we need to tweak this top bit then i'm guessing the wood adds a bit of flexibility i mean that worked sort of but uh we didn't get the start and it failed that did get the start okay okay we're back we're back oh it breaks badly though what broke you broke your steel you're not meant to break what if i add a little thing down there i should probably turn turn the stress on oh that worked we're down to 40 grand okay that's not too bad where's that in oh my goodness we've done it top one percent straight away <laughs> Oh, I was not expecting that. Shall we try and go higher? Have we beaten Aliens Rock? Oh, we have. Beaten by 2k. Smashed him. I mean, I was nowhere near done trimming this. Let me just do a little bit more because I reckon make the middle of those muscles steel. Bring them a lot closer together. Potentially swap those with wood. I mean, I could probably do that to wood as well. Let's see if that works. Oh, it does. It changes the jump. Oh, that's quite annoying. So what was it that did it? Was it changing? Yeah, changing those. Oh, wow. And it breaks really badly now. Okay, so the point that changes it is if I make the middle of those muscles wood, then this breaks. <laughs> That makes no sense. I mean, it probably does somehow. But yeah, so the middle of those muscles, they got to stay as steel. So, I mean, do I need that? I probably don't need that, do I? Yes, I do. Okay, fair enough. Well, that's that's our answer. Top 1%, I'm going to take it. Uh, mostly because I want to get in the gallery, sort it by lowest budget, and see how I did. So this one is half what mine... Co what is that? Wait, what? Oh my goodness. And it just gets out the way of that. Is that going to knock it up? Oh my goodness. <laughs> How? What? How, like, look at look at how that's hung up as well. Like, it's there's a wooden rope holding that steel in place. Let's just watch this again. So that spins around. I don't know if you saw. They look at the very start. Can you see from up here that bit of road falls down so that as it lands, it stops it rolling back or forwards too far. Oh my god! This must have taken so long. I'd love to say it's engineering, but it's complete fluke. <laughs> 
<laughs> anyway, this one, 22 grand. Another, like, falling thing. Yeah, it's all about flinging the cars back and then getting over. That one does break, though. This one, oh, quite similar to mine, but, like, a lot smoother and a lot less road. It just does, like, a jump at the end. You can see it's got, like, the steel arch that mine had as well, though. Uh, this one, is it a similar thing? No, lots of people are flinging, flinging cars back. Makes sense. This one, what? This is so rickety. How did that not break? <laughs> oh, man. These are, like, really cheap as well. How's this one going to work? Oh, it does It does go round, but without the falling stuff. And then a little bit of middle middle road there. Man, so many different ways of doing this one. Fair play. Lots of people take advantage of doing wheelies. Get a bit of style points in. I sort of forgot to do that. Oh, this is what I sort of tried to do, like, at the start. Like, come back down. Just a little, like, like a spine ramp. Like, skateboarding spine. Nice. This one has a foundation. Did the last one have a foundation? Yeah, they both have foundations. This is the cheapest loop. Does cost more than mine, so glad I didn't do the loop. But uh, you can see the steel arch again. That's supporting everything. But yeah, nice. Let's have a look at the highest budget. See whether people put that budget to use or not. Um, I, I would say so, sort of. <laughs> Alan. Alan! I mean, I'm not going to complain about RCE propaganda. That is for sure. Oh my god. I feel like this person just like gave up. It, like, oh, it still breaks. All that steel and it still breaks breaks. I guess sharks are not as smart as dolphins. Maybe they are the architect of the sea world. Anyway, what is going on here? It's not going to drive all the way around that. No. Oh, no, it isn't. It literally isn't. But it catches and dies, but it just about makes it. Uh, this one. What is that? Look at all the steel muscles to get that to not break. Wow. It's got like tension underneath as well and a foundation. <laughs> I mean, at least you can see where the budget's gone, I guess. Uh, this one, what is going on here? So it goes up, does that. Oh, it comes down to the bottom and then back up. Oh, that's also by a simple shark. This one, so much steel. This one, oh, look how smooth it is, though. Oh, it's got like a loop at the end. Oh, I would actually ride that one. Like, like a roller coaster. That looks so smooth and fun. Yeah, most of the other expensive ones are just like loops and stuff everywhere. Uh, makes sense. Loops, pretty expensive. A lot of road... A lot of reinforcement required. Now, this one, which I'm not just showing for the RCE propaganda. Look, it does a loop and then comes back that way before looping round and then heading to the flag. So technically, it goes through the flag twice, that one. Yeah, lots of lots of different ways of doing this. Quite, quite fun to look on the old gallery. But I think we'll head on to the next level. Batteries included. We've got 30 grand, a load of stuff. Stuff. Oh no, hydraulics. Hydraulics. We have hydraulics. Wait, actually, we don't have hydraulics. Oh, okay. So these hydraulics, we can't move. We can't change the length of them either. So we've got to build a bridge where these hydraulics moves the bridge. Ooh, that's quite interesting. So what have we actually got to do? We've got to get a police car through the star in the middle over to there. But a boat is coming at some point. It's coming before the police car moves. Okay, so build a bridge, then get out of the way with hydraulics, then put it back got it so first things first i think it's just a simple straight road 20 meters long push that into place and then oh look how look how perfectly that works for wood that can't be coincidence maybe we'll grid on this one to start with so i'm guessing that's probably the bit that's going to get pulled out the way so if i joint that then all i need to do all i need to do he says is sort of support that maybe do a bit of that so that should be pull that up and then I just need to support that bit and then I think if I just do two ropes to there that should hold that in place if that makes sense so yeah something like that let's copy that to the other side and then that may work potentially oh they sort of go a little bit too high but we are not gonna touch we are not touching the pirate ship the big question now is will this settle and lock together I'm not convinced but oh it does it does please work please please. We did a hydraulic level first time. We did a hydraulic level first time. Where are we on that lead? Oh, no. What? Bottom 13%. I've got to get to the top 1%. Oh, well, that's not ideal, really, is it? <laughs> okay. 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 How are we going to do this then? I didn't realize I used like all my budget. If I can get rid of those bottom two. If I press play, that's just going to fall down, isn't it? Yeah. Although, is that okay? I think it will dodge the ship. I just don't think it will go back to where it's meant to. So I think what I need to do, I need to connect from that hinge point down there. So basically, if I just connect like all these together, I mean, maybe I could get rid of that steel. But yeah, look. Look how this one works. It like, it stays there and then completely implodes. Oh, it's just annoying. It like, if I could change the, how much 
watch the hydraulic moves, it would it would be fine, but but I can't. Um, I do wonder actually. Maybe do I not want like a hinge there? Do I want to try moving like yeah that much of the bridge? Oh, that goes high enough. Turn the stress off. Ah, oh, okay, that goes high enough. So let's just delete all that. Swap with that. Yeah, that should work. And we're we're down to eighteen and a half grand now. Oh, okay, I think I've worked out. I've just got to do this and try and make this cheap because I can I can really trim down this design. I reckon we just have to make sure it's strong enough. Stress. Oh, I went up to. 83% there. But now we're in the top 18%. So we've gone from the bottom to the top. Yeah, we've still got a lot of trimming to go though. Okay, so how do I want to trim this? Can I swap rope for wood? Yes, I can. How do I make these cheaper? I mean, I can bring these down probably quite a bit. I mean, maybe if I if I do that, is that the cheapest way? I can then probably bring down these back ones turn the stress on so you can see that these muscles they're quite stressed actually when the police car goes across oh it fails oh because you broke so i do need rope up there do i yeah with rope in it works uh, this doesn't feel very cheap though we're in oh we're in the top eight percent we're moving the right direction we're 690th nice sort of just hide the zero with my mouse nice uh, question is now how do i get my truss smaller because the thing is like these are all quite long like 363 quid each i could try and bring the road up to the node or maybe just maybe what if i were to delete all of that try and keep that sort of like in a straight line and then do my truss like down down there because is that cheaper like this side cost 8550 the original side cost 8600 oh, so i only saved like 50 quid what about this then there must be a way to do this for cheap but still be strong so first i want to make sure this holds the police car which it doesn't so you have to go up okay that did work and that's still a little bit cheaper oh no it's actually it's more expensive now great okay so we'll go back to that design then i need to try and sort this i think that's 2400 I basically need this node and the bottom to like all support itself. Ah, ha, 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 ha. What if I do that? So I've basically just got wood to like hold that in place. I've still got the rope, but then I've made this support itself with like a, a wall brace underneath. So let's turn the stress on and then see. Oh, no, the wall brace is not very strong. I mean, I can't really bring it down. What I could do is put road under there bring it back what does that cost it's cheaper it's a few hundred quid cheaper and it's strong enough okay okay so doing it on both sides where does that put us on the leaderboard we're under 17 grand now top six percent we're moving in the right direction i'm i'm struggling i'm not gonna lie maybe i do need to bring the road up i don't know what can i do about these trusses because i basically want these to be like as low as possible but i still need to connect to that and i'm pretty sure if i just do that that will just like flop down won't it yeah i think i've got to make this like a straight line to connect but then it's got to be strong enough to oh ooh. is that cheaper 8287 8004 oh it is cheaper hello so where does oh my goodness <laughs> the stress went up to 96 that puts us in the top Five percent. We've still got so far to go. How can I save money? Can I swap that for wood? I did try, but not on this design. Right, ready, ready, right. No, it breaks. It breaks. That has to be rope. Can I move that anywhere that's cheaper? Left is the cheapest. Oh, could I do that? Could I delete you and make that just like a wooden rope? So it's going to have flex, but it's one less piece. Oh, it didn't work. Although it was that side that broke. Maybe if I mirror, it will. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, okay, that did work. That's like a couple of hundred quid saved. Where are we? Oh, we only gained a percent there. What more can I do? I mean, I guess I can bring that to the right. No, that makes things more expensive. I've got to bring it to the left. No, I've got to be somewhere in the middle to be the cheapest. Oh, I've got to bring it down. Oh, I've got to bring it down. I can't bring it down though. It's got to be straight. It's got to be straight with a hydraulic so it doesn't flop. So, yeah, I reckon there. Okay, and then I guess just pixel tweak. Is that all I've got left? I mean, unless I could get away with swapping these from road. No, I can't. They just break. They break instantly. they got to be road. It's got to make them really small then, I guess. Oh, no. How are you hanging on? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> That is very, very impressive. I'm not going to lie. We're in the top 3%. I can't see what else I can do, to be honest. I need to get rid of these roads. They, they're not working. That's too expensive. But that breaks. If I were to move all these to the left a bit, I could lift that bit of road up. That will give this a lot more strength. And move all these 
back to the right. Then I'm like higher up to this, like I said earlier. Then I can connect like that. The only issue then is we're not sort of in the middle. So if I go from here, we don't quite reach. Although, although, do I need to reach? Can we not just do that? Do like a jump? We may be able to do a jump. Okay, okay. I have renewed faith. So what if we go for this? Looking good. Oh, not looking good. Okay, you broke. Fine, we'll put road. Do I put road back in or do I just move this? Let's just put road back in for now. It's more expensive, but it gives me a way to trim it later. I just need to see if this works, like if the jump at the end works and stuff. So it comes back down, touches tips, and then this guy drives over. Does he? He doesn't make the jump. But I mean, we could just sort of raise that up a bit. I don't think I can push these to the right anymore. Okay, so finally got something to work. We're back over 17 grand though. So <laughs> this is way more expensive. All right, let's lose under support. Let's try, let's try something different. What if we try and lift up the entire bridge? No, that sounds silly. That does sound silly. We stick with what we were doing, Matt. Come on, it was working. All right, I'm down to 16 grand. This sort of works. I just put like thin muscles in there. The trouble with this one is as the police car comes over, it doesn't make it. So just shove road in there. Lift that up a bit, maybe. Okay, so it worked extending this bit of road, but then we're sort of back to like the price that we were. I mean, if we keep this extra bit of road, that does mean we can go higher. Yeah, so what I'm thinking then, if we go, let's just go like as high as we can, then over to there we're gonna need we're gonna need an extra piece but yeah as i said at the start if we're higher if we're close to that there's less truss required so then we need to support this so let's do a muscle up there i mean yeah what if i bring that down okay that works sort of it's a big triangle there shove our rope back in okay there's potential to do it that way you can see i've actually i've moved the thing back to the start i can't remember why i originally why i decided to raise more bridge rather than less but i feel like this this is going to be a lot stronger if i do like a truss there this is remarkably cheaper as well so i imagine it's not going to be strong enough my trusses are quite small in the middle yeah okay so knowing that i don't actually need that piece do i that can just be one of those. Oh, and actually, all these we can move left to make actual triangles. Yeah, that works. That looks quite good. That's quite yellow or red. Oh, it nearly worked. It nearly worked. Okay, just raise raise that up. Is that gonna work? Is that oh stop breaking your knob? I may have to Oh, your knobs. <laughs> Maybe I'll lower this side just to get the the trusses a little bit bigger. That sort of thing. It cost me a few hundred quid, but if it's stronger. Yes. Okay, we are cruising up the leaderboard now. I can't believe it finally worked. Oh, 75th. We're in the top 1%. We did it. Finally. Oh, finally. I can actually, I can probably make this way cheaper, can't I? Like these trusses, if I do something sketchy like that, uh, it will just collapse. But I can probably find a point where it doesn't collapse. Like that worked for the hydraulics. Does it hold the police car? Yes, but the rest of the bridge broke. Still, we'll do the same on this side. Actually, I could possibly get away with doing that. Because I got a bit of give in these roads. Oh, that's red though. That is red. But we know the jump earlier does work. Let's just see. Are we strong enough? No, we're not. What's... Oh, you're breaking again. Okay, as before then, we'll just bring these down a bit. And then please, please. Oh, no. Oh, you broke. Okay, maybe that can't be wood. Yeah, okay. We'll keep you as road. We won't be getting under 15 grand today. But 15,137. We're 55th in the world. Did we beat Tyler? Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, man. No. <laughs> I thought I was done with this level, but we're not. I'm not sure I can... I might have to give him this one. I don't think I can compete with that. Yeah, honestly, I'm letting him have that. I'm sick of this level. Let's uh, let's go have a look. Lowest budget. What? Have, oh, what have we got? What is... What? <laughs> what are we looking at? It just makes me... Oh, there's a jump in the middle. How does that... I don't understand this game sometimes. Oh, man. All these are dodgy as anything. I mean, I quite like the curves. Fair play. This one. Oh, this one's cool. Look how small the trusses are. So, yeah, similar sort of thing with the rope. They went very high at the end to do the jump. Maybe that's where I went wrong. Oh, lots of these are quite similar, actually. Yeah, pretty much every design is the same. I think they're quite samey to what I came up with in the end. I mean, that's... 
sort of like what I did originally, I think. But yeah, oh, tell you what, this, this level's giving me an headache. Damn hydraulics. I didn't even have to do the hydraulics. It did just hurt me. Anyway, what have we got here? Maverick with the double dong solution with oh, the, the water dynamic weight there and the RCE propaganda in the background. This is real engineering. Oh my goodness, the size of that face. He had a very long nose, that person. Anyway, then we got this one. Oh, that's nice. Oh, look, and it's the Nifty sponsored solution. Nifty for all your tea needs as well as nifty bridge solutions for batteries included. I don't know what to say. Actually, that surprises me that, that was the nifty sponsored solution because look over here. Nifty flavored pie <laughs> coming to the nifty store soon. Mmm, it's nifty but in a pie. Designed by Rye the Pie. All right, this one just looks like a normal bridge. Is that just using steel? It got that expensive? That's... Oh, okay. That's where the budget went. Cheers, Alan. Alan! All right, and then we got this one. Oh, they didn't Wait, what? They use their own hydraulics? That's cheating. <laughs> How do they get their own hydraulics in? I don't know. They were very impressive hydraulics, though. I will give you that. Um, oh, suspension bridge. Yes, please, Payden. We've got... Wait, what is going on here? They dropped the hydraulics. No way. They just use wood. I reckon... The car's gonna, like, nudge that. I didn't even nudge it. Wait, what? How? What? <laughs> My mind is blown. I don't understand. I do not understand. I'm not worthy. That's all I do understand. This one, again, not using the hydraulics. Oh, it drags the car across. Get it across before the... <laughs> Before the boat hits the bridge. That's genius. Oh, go Saigon as well. Nice one, dude. Uh, this one, what? I just look at these. I'm like, it's going to do something cool, but I can't work it out. And then the bridge just hold lifts up. That just... <laughs> that's that's hydraulics. I do understand for some reason. All right, this one. Oh, low stress. What? How did, what? How did you get writing up there? Only 24% stressed. Ooh. I tell you what, I was actually thinking maybe a future video. Should we try and go for like the low stress leaderboard? I feel like it's been, it's been missed out. Mostly because there's not a gallery for low stress, which is a bit of a shame. So yeah, let me know in the comments if you want to see that. For now, we're going on to the next level. So this one's called two at a time, which is exactly how I take my chocolate biscuits in my tea. And yes, that is nifty in an architect tears mug. The ultimate engineering combo. But okay, what we got? What have we got here? Oh my goodness. What actually have we got here? Oh, we've only got six bits of road. Oh, it's a hydraulic level. Right, I'll tell you what then. Rather than putting you through the pain of more hydraulics, I'm just going to try and figure this out. And you guys can experience engineering time. I measure spans and I calculate so my bridges will disintegrate. Staying up all night to design a truss. Being so comfy, it was a must. So I bridged in my path. And the stuff to do and you're working from home. Got to remove all clothing engineering alone when there's too much work the only thing to do is bridge in my pants architect's dream but i follow through turning their sketches into something true rather than doing overtime i'd rather go home and then just quit because i can't be dealing with this stuff anymore okay so i think this is as cheap as i can get it without making the hydraulics smaller because they cost three grand each. Six grand just on the hydraulics. But uh, this is this is the way that works. And basically, I've just got like a big triangle that sort of holds this, this in place. So that when we press play, look, this guy can go across like that. And then those top nodes are just held in place. So that raises up. This one lowers down. They all lock in so those can go. And then they just go back together. So the Moog peg can go back. And I've made these as like cheap as possible. We got wooden ropes in there. Wooden muscles up the top. They did start as steel. Uh, we're in the top 8%. I don't know if I can actually make this any cheaper. Uh, we smashed Tyler and it's a hydraulic level. So I'm sort of happy with that. Yes, it's not 1%, but it's hydraulics. So let's have a look in the gallery. So lowest budget. It cost... 8,999 quid. Wait, what? I mean, there's a lot of bouncing and a lot of a lot of just random jankiness. Uh, all the oh no, all these cheap ones are like that. Like, look at all these. What's going on here? <laughs> what is good? Actually, that was quite cool. That was actually quite cool. Uh, first sort of legit one. Yeah, you got to get the small hydraulics in. Do these just like rotate? No, that does lift the entire thing up and down. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. One day I will learn hydraulics and then my power will show no no bounds. Uh, but until that time, I'm just a lowly civil engineer. We don't do moving stuff. I'm pretty sure I did it the cheapest like vertical hydraulic sort of movement. Oh, this one only has one hydraulic. How is this going to work? Does it all spin? Oh, it spin. Oh my God. Oh, my head. My head can't work this one out. By the way, we're on page three. They're all still cheaper than mine. Like, look at that. 
What? Oh, man. I mean, it's got four hydraulics, but look how cool it is. Not that I think hydraulics are cool. They're definitely not. I mean, oh, man. People are too clever. It's not fair. Anyway, let's go to the fun. Oh, my goodness. What? even is that is it a mess or is it clever oh boy oh boy it's clever it's clever you can't do that you can't do that <laughs> i just struggled to like do like the most simplest thing ever and no nah, i'm not having that i'm not having that next yes rce propaganda oh it's the nifty sponsored solution as well gotta love your nifty brew nifty might actually coming to a store near you because i'm actually talking to a tea manufacturer let's hope the real nifty doesn't sue me for this uh what does that does that say engineer wait does it say any oh no it says sub to rce legend super size that is hydraulics i can get behind uh, this one. Oh, what is that are there like two eyes? Oh, it's a mouth. Is it a mouth? A munching mouth. This one. What is that? It's like a giant like mushroom or a squid or something. Uh, this one. What? What's with all the dangling? Oh, they wait. There's no hydraulics. There's no hydraulics. There's no There's no hydraulics. I don't understand how people come up with these. Hello, Noah, one million. Oh, yeah. Cheers. Cheers for that. Oh, what is going on here? It's like the eye. The hydraulic eye. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Wow. Okay. Okay, this person knows how hydraulics work. Um, oh, what? No, no, my head, my head hurts. My head hurts. All right, we got loads of cables. I feel like, is that just the movement I did? Oh, <laughs> I have no clue what I'm looking at with these. I'm just here for the for the RC propaganda though. So what did they do? What movement did... Oh, they did straight up, straight down, but way cleverer than I did. Anyway, I'm loving on this bridge. There's just like a giant bunny that's had his ears cropped. He's lost his ears. Or maybe the ears are just like behind the back. But yeah, definitely a bunny. You can tell by the big feet. All right, well, anyway, these are way too clever for me. Uh, next time we are on to out of order, which thankfully isn't a hydraulic level. But yeah, for now, I'm going to say peace, love, and three sheep difficulties quite tough. Bye, guys.